Twice the night before Christmas, and all through the Hold house... it now, wait, hold it. That's played out. Hit it! Spread your, spread your, spread your love is Christmas. 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 Jingle bells, hit them bells, send us on his way. Gifts to you, gifts to me, reindeers in the sleigh. Just the season is the reason, spread love everywhere. Good morning, welcome back to another day. Okay, it's Tuesday, not a busy Tuesday, but me and my homegirl down on the floor, me and my little best friend, it's gonna go to the grocery store and run some errands. So y'all come on with us to go to the grocery store and run some errands. Y'all see us standing? Let's tell her to walk already, cause mama wanna walk. So let me get her packed up. We gotta go get a little bit of groceries and she needs some wipes so we gotta get some wipes. I don't know how I'm feeling this week. I washed it yesterday. And I just don't know how I'm feeling today. But I'm gonna pack us up. Come on, Harm. 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 Come on. Y'all, she's so smart. She be knowing. She be knowing that I be talking about. Good, good. She got me. So, yes. Me and Harm are finna head out the door. I need to find some socks because I want to put some shoes. It is actually cold outside. <coughs> Y'all, it is freezing. I want to put Tia on the bus this morning. Freezing. Put the boys on the um To the bus table this morning. Freezing. So, hopefully, then it got a little warmer. Harmony got on her little two piece sweater suit. I got on this. It's a tank top up under here. I love the sweat. I would have sweat a lot. Tank top up under here. And then I got on some, uh, I think these are called yoga pants. I don't know. Wide flare lid pants. And I'm finna put on my little, my Nike pit ten, tennis shoes. And we finna go to the grocery store. I'm finna make her a bottle before we leave. So she can drink the bottle in the car. So when we get in the Walmart, she won't be in the cutting food in the people's store. I need to get some baby snacks. Alright, so it is. Now three. Let's get out the door. All right, ma'am. I can't ID from you real quick. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. All right. Do you want your receipt? No, I'm fine. No receipt? Okay. Mm -hmm. Have a great day. You too. Thank you. Of course. Y'all, so like I totally forgot that I had to go get tickets medicine. So since I was passing my pharmacy, I just swooped in here real quick to pick up. It's not his daily medicine, but it's definitely his emergency man. Since we just recently had a seizure, I need it on hand. I have um the med, the rectal version of it. Still, I still have those. I'm not getting rid of those to the expire, just in case. But they, they moved him over to the nasal spray version of it, so I just had to stop and grab those. Now we're on our way to Walmart. Now, which is like three minutes of the road. <laughs> so let's go. Sorry for the loud cars. Drive like crazy people. We just left Walmart. I got what I needed to cook food for today. So this is what I'm gonna cook. I'm sorry, y'all. Let me put on my seatbelt. Don't call me out like that, Dodge. I'm gonna throw down some gumbo. I've never cooked gumbo before, okay? So this is gonna be my first time, and we're gonna see how it go. I found a recipe, we're gonna see if it tastes good, if they like. I've tried gumbo once, okay, from a restaurant. Um, so I'm gonna do some gumbo rice and some cornbread. This is also gonna be my first time making cornbread from scratch, because I ain't never did that either. I've been a Jiffy girl, and I don't mind being a Jiffy girl. I would Jiffy your cornbread to death. I don't care. I understand I got all these Research toxins. I, I don't care. I will cook. Corn, I'm gonna cook some Jiffy cornbread, okay? Um, and then I'm gonna make some brownies probably later, not right now. But so I'm gonna do some rice, gumbo, cornbread for dinner. But I'm gonna go and cook it now. It's 10:34. Go ahead and cook it. Get it out of the way. Plus, I want my husband to be able to take some work with him, so he can't me. And then. That's pretty much it, cause I got this medicine already. I got a box of wipes out of Walmart. I was gonna go get them from Sam's, but I decided to grab some out of Walmart. I grabbed some from Sam's on Friday. That way I'd be extra stylish. Cause I already had to get some more, I'm about needing to get some more diapers. So I'm gonna do that too. 
But that's it. And we finna stop by the Dollar General to get some pans because I don't want to be doing all these dishes and some paper plates or paper bowls. This is gumbo. And that's it. So I'll see y'all when we get home. Alright, so back home. From the store. Let's cook dinner early. Get it out the way. Alright, so boom. I'm home. And it's time to cook. So I'm gonna try this gumbo. I'm gonna try this cornbread and I'm gonna put some rice. It is 1121. Let's see how quick I can get this night. According to the recipe, I need to go back and look. Yep. It says it takes, it has a cook time of 25 minutes, which probably means y'all know I don't, don't come for me because I know I, I know for a fact that the real gumbo, like the, the gumbo gumbo, don't take 25 minutes to cook. I'm pretty sure it takes a whole lot more time than that. So it says put the gear in the pan, blah, blah, blah. Alright, so I gotta cut this. Let's move some stuff over on my counter here, my cooking counter. Spend the winter all alone, yeah. Cause I don't please fall. I don't please fall. Yeah, yeah. yeah. See, had to ask a question if you happy, girl. I change your mind anytime in this happy world. Let's go and kick it, you and me, and see what love unfurls. Cause, girl, I bet you love some tugging on them lovely curls. Hold up a week up after that, believe we started dating. My heart was racing, but never felt my time was wasting. My mind was chasing, ain't no debating. I'm feeling you and trying to get together, figure out what to do. Even after some disasters, we were making it work. But never did I ever think that you would do in the dirt. Stay cute while you smile in your brand new skirt just happy that we've been together and we never get hurt so say girl why you kick it with them guys all dumb if you ever got some worries one with me all done change the picture that you paint until the paint all gone because i'm just falling for the artists like your name on some like wonder if you spend the winter all alone yeah because i don't please fall i don't please fall Cause I know you want more Trying to see what's between us and not what we got in store But the pain we feel is real and still it got me feeling so yeah. You've been feeling me and I've been feeling you Wondering on what we really trying to do Thinking every night Laying up in bed and wonder if it's true Hoping that the pain I'm feeling won't it too Got me feeling like
gumbo gumbo. And now I'm gonna do the cornbread. All right, so I've got a golden sweet cornbread recipe. I'm gonna try this one. It looks good. Um, I am gonna double this recipe, however. As it says, it's for servings of 24. I'm gonna make a seven. I mean, servings of 12. I'm gonna make a serving of 24. Um, one nine inch round. I'm not also not using a round nine inch pan. I'm using square pans. So let's go down. For the recipe that I did is I add some crawfish in here. It smells so good. Gotta follow my husband. Let's go ahead and my husband try this gumbo. Cause I think I did. Oh god, I almost died. So Cornbread is still kind of hot because I just cooked it and it just came out the oven. I don't know if I'm supposed to take it. Yeah, it's Snap. Make cornbread from scratch. Snap. So I'm making something much? Damn right. Still waiting on the rice to be done. And I made some brownies. You want a brownie? Mm-hmm. I'm 
put no weed in it though. Mm -hmm. Cause I made some brownies too. Put weed in it. I didn't put weed in it. Cause I don't have any. And the children don't eat the brownies. Mm -hmm. That is shrimp. And I put some crawfish in it too. I see. You see the one there's inside? Mm-hmm. You think I can sell it? Mm-hmm. I think I should be in close to my house. Mm-hmm. I know I'm going to cook though, because I don't like cooking. Mm-hmm. My feet are in I'm gonna get my bowl back. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get my bowl back. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess I did good. <laughs> now, I'm gonna fix something and let grandma taste the taste the food to see what See what grandma think. She watch our stories, so we're gonna disturb her. But shit, she ain't even there, y'all. I don't think we need a big flashy. I'm in the bathroom, but I am finna get me a little bowl, cause this gonna bowl looking like some gonna bowl. If you from New Orleans, if you from New Orleans, now you gotta tell me if my gumbo look like y'all gumbo. I doubt it do. Boom, oh, dinner is done. It's 1.30 something. I don't even know. It's uh 1.35. My husband's about to leave. Go to work. I'm probably about to take me a quick nap. How many sleep? I'm probably about to take me a quick nap. And so take you get here. Listen, I ain't no regular person. Let me tell y'all. So I'm a best friend. Uh, so I'm gonna go to my gumbo. I'm gonna order my son's job. She's fixing my gumbo. Got me a little bowl here. Hey, little bowl here. She's fixing my gumbo. I'll be back. Gotta hurry up. Cause I'm gonna sign. Let me know I'm not. I'm gonna go. Best friend's fixing my gumbo. Let's see if she like my gumbo. Let's go. So my best friend. Can try this gumbo, y'all. I'm proud of myself. I don't know. It's like when I cook something that's good, I want I want too many people to try it. My husband and my best friend. And then I want the clan to try it because my kids, they gonna say, Mama, it's nasty. We don't like it. I they gonna be like, oh, Mama, this 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 right here, middle of the century, keep cooking this. Cook this four, five, six, seven, eight more times. So we gonna see. Daddy passed the test. I let grandma try, grandma passed the test. Now I'm on with my best friend and I'm waiting on my minions again so they can tell me whether or not it's good, good. okay? It's expensive to make, don't nobody tell me. Let me not, let me not say that. So for all the stuff that I bought, not just including, I bought all this stuff and then I bought wipes and stuff like that. I spent like $157 on stuff today, which ain't bad, I'll take that price. stuff that I got every time. So I see y'all when I'm with my best friend to see if she approved of my gumbo. Oh, I forgot to grab her some Benadryl. She at work. She get Benadryl for work. So she used to have a shellfish allergy. She can eat. She can eat fish now. Um, she eats some shrimp now. So just in case she already at work, it's Benadryl at her job. In case she needs some Benadryl, I know they got an EpiPen right around there in case she needs some EpiPen. But she's never had a severely bad reaction to it. Like normally, it's just like some itching and stuff and. So find it, but we finna see it, so let's go. Hello. I'm all back. Girl, I don't see what kind of taste you see. It's something like a fucking cheek. Oh what? Feeding very high protein. Y'all just forget we're doing the most. She does so much. It is so fun. 
Who's in her car? I was like, get the fuck out of my car. What the fuck are you doing? That car comes right there. <laughs> Delicious bowl of gumbo with the rice. So I just took some of my best friend to try y'all. She loved it. She had the whole bowl. We was there for like 10 minutes and she had the whole bowl, y'all. I'm gonna start her little clip of all these. And she had, she felt good. So. Alright, so now I'm finna go home, y'all. I'm tired now. I'm finna go home, fix me a little bowl of it, and lay my behind down on the sofa and take a nap. Yes. Alright, so I cannot. Y'all, excuse where I look. Be the only person that has a child that wants to sign up for every activity at school, okay? The child is like, it is 6.20 at night. And I have been trying to rest for the last few hours because Mother Nature, y'all, yeah, she takes she takes a lot out of me, okay? Along with the fact that I already get up at 4 in the morning. To man the house, to man the kids, get them out of school, blase blase. Despite all that, Mother Nature takes a lot out of me. Just like she just drains me. There's there's not really any pain or anything, but it just drains the energy out of me. So it's 6:25, and I'm on the way to pick Sayana up from her bus stop because the bus that she catches in the afternoon doesn't drop off actually by the house like a regular afternoon bus. This is like an activity after the bus, and this thing drops off like 10 minutes from the house, okay? And I mean 10 minutes of driving from the house. I have to drive and go pick her up. And 9 times out of 10, I'm also picking up a friend of hers as well. And that friend stays like outside of our subdivision, across the street, down the street from our house. So I have to, I drop her off home too. I don't mind doing it. I, I'm the, the neighborhood mom, but it's what it is. Um, but yeah, so, but y'all, I just came over really to wrap up this vlog because I promised that I'm going to start wrapping my vlogs up because y'all know I, I, I'm good for leaving y'all on a cliffhanger. But if I, if you leave y'all on a cliffhanger from now on, it's going to be because there's something good coming in the next video. This one's not it. Well, it could be something good. Um, I've had a lot of conversations with my husband today before I let him go to work, before he went to work. Uh, we talked about a few things pretty much you know 2024 is almost here and where's my mindset with that and stuff like that and plans and stuff that i have going on ideas things i want to do um so it's just it's just trying to get, start putting plans to paper and actually detail planning and organizing and stuff make it realistic and make it happen and putting in the work behind it early instead of waiting until it's 2024 to start because if i'm waiting to 2024 then things won't happen things won't get done I, I know me we go through this every year okay but not this year this year we're changing we're better people in 2024 so let me go grab this girly and her friend get them home and i was editing the vlog i mean a video a, a short form vlog while i was in a few ticket food and so when i come back i lay when I, but when i come back I'm gonna get him laid down. I already laid Harmony down. I just laid her down before I left. So. Anyways, I love y'all. Good night. Y'all know what to do. Hit that button down at the bottom. Come on over here to the family. It's a whole, it's, it, it's a whole heap of us over here. It is what it is. Come on, join. What are you doing? What What are you doing? Jo Pick the dog on bite. Love you. I'll see you in the next vlog, fam. No, I'm just right here. You're not a stranger. That was a big old truck. <laughs>